Now in the last lesson we looked at how to create individual points. You might also be wondering how do I connect those points. So let's take a quick look at that. I'll start with my geometry node and like the last lesson we'll add the add node to create individual points. Let's start by adding a point. We've got one point right in the origin there. I might make these a little bit bigger so you can see them better on the screen. So I'll go into guides, point marker size, and I'll put that up to its eight, its maximum there. Oh, and also might help if I turn on the points. So let's create another one um, right here. And let's create this one in X. So now I have my two points again. Now to be able to add a line between these is very simple. All I need to do is go into polygons and I can by group and I add the line. Very simple. What I can also do is if I prefer is I can go into my create another add node and I can also go to polygons by group and add that line. Sometimes you might prefer to do it this way so that you can keep things more organized. So I can add that point and I'll create this one and I'll call this one lines. Okay. Of course I can add more to this so I might decide that I want to add another point. So let's add another point here and that will be let's say one in X and one in Z. All right back to my lines and it automatically adds that line in there. And you can see here that we have three points, which is correct. We've got one primitive and one polygon. It counts this or uses this as one, one polygon, one primitive. Okay. So I hope that's helpful. If you have any questions, please leave them below. Thank you.